Hey everyone, my name is Chad Fredrickson and I created the Local Lead Plan Program. If you're involved in internet marketing at all, you may have seen my blog, cdfnetworks.com, which I've been running for the last four years. This all started back in late 2005 when I was doing affiliate marketing and pay-per-click. Through a lot of hard work, I was actually fortunate enough to fulfill my dream of quitting my day job as a network administrator. And ever since then, I've been working full-time for myself, growing my own business. So about that same time, I started applying some of these techniques that I was using towards local businesses that a friend of mine ran. I actually didn't know it at the time because there wasn't a label for it, but what I was doing was local lead generation. And ever since then, I've been expanding into that field more and more, helping new businesses gain customers using this technique. Um, the last two years is when it's really blown up, and my company's now working with local and national businesses all over the country. So I'm at the point now where I have a great system in place, great strategies for running local lead generation businesses, and that's why I wrote this guide to share it. And when I set out to create this course, I told myself I wanted to accomplish two main goals. Number one, I didn't want to hold back on any information. I wanted to put out all the knowledge and tips that I've learned doing local lead gen. And two, I wanted to make it affordable for everyone, and I didn't want it to have a high price point that would be a barrier of entry to people. I wanted it to be accessible to everyone, and I've definitely accomplished both of those goals with this course. I actually intended to put this product out as a physical book, but when I looked into the publishing process, it was way too time consuming, so I decided let's go with the electronic route. Now, to be honest, I was very hesitant to write an ebook at first because the sales letter pages and the high pressure tactics really put me off. So I decided if I am going to go this route, I'm going to be different in almost every way. Hopefully, you're like me and you're finding this approach refreshing change over the usual ways you've seen ebooks promoted in the past. So, the bottom line, it's just a straight up product. It's as simple as that. There's no magic secrets or get rich quick schemes. I'm going to tell you exactly what it's about in this video and you can decide if it's right for you. Um, I think the course has enough value to stand on its own without having to entice people into buying it with sales tactics. So that's kind of where I stand. So let's get started and I'll show you exactly what this local lead plan is all about. Local lead generation is something you've probably read bits and pieces about here and there, but until now nobody's written a comprehensive guide on how to do it. So I wanted to document every step of the process along the way from finding a customer to getting paid and everything in between. There's a lot of small details that go into local lead gen that can really trip you up if you aren't careful. It's a lot different than running an affiliate offer on a network because you have to take care of everything yourself. Uh, this guide will take you step by step through each aspect of doing local lead gen. I'll present the strategies, the best practices, things to watch out for, tips and hints along the way. So now if you want to hang with me, I'll go through each chapter and just give a few brief points about what it's about. Alright, so chapter one is why local lead generation. In this first chapter, I discuss the field of local lead gen. I talk about the state of the market, the skill sets you'll need, the opportunities available, and all the background information about local lead gen. Chapter two is about finding customers. In this chapter, I'll tell you about why finding customers is often the hardest part of the whole process, but I give you a lot of sources for new customers. I'll show you a list of 83 proven niches that I've found for local lead generation. I'll even show you a way you can get all the customers you'll ever need without ever having to cold call anybody. Now chapter 3 is about the pitch and the first proposal. So I'll tell you how to sell your services to a new client. I talk about how to do market research, how to hit the main selling points of local lead gen, uh, whether or not you should offer a free trial, um, I'll also go into whether or not you should write a sales proposal if you have a, a customer that's not really buying your services right off the bat, and I give a sample proposal of how to do that. In Chapter 4, we'll assume that they're interested in your services, but now what questions do you need to ask? So I'll talk about the critical topics that you need to address with them, like determining the action or the goals, um, geo-targeting, demographics, all the questions that need to be answered before you can move forward with the service. Chapter 5 is about the important topic of pricing your leads. Here I'll go over all the different pricing options you can use for leads and I'll also talk about my negotiating strategies for getting the top dollar for your leads. Next up we'll talk about the website decisions that have to be made before you can go forward. 
Should you use your own website? Should you use the client's websites? What kind of landing pages should you do? What are the positives and negatives for doing all these types of strategies? I'll hit all those points in this chapter. In chapter 7 I go over handling web leads. Here I'll talk about how you process all the leads, how the client's going to receive them, how to track them. I'll also talk about how to handle leads so they convert at a higher rate. Um, I go over scrubbing and cleaning up and all the details of how you're going to handle a web lead. The phone leads and paper call section is something I'm really excited about. I go over all the new technologies that allow you to track and utilize phone calls as you would leads and how it can really boost your profits on local lead gen campaigns. I'll show you scripts that you can use with your campaigns and discuss how to price phone leads differently than web leads and basically just go over all the aspects of running phone leads. Chapter 9 is about tracking your payments and billing your clients. Um, after all, you have to get paid, so I go over tracking commissions, how to set up payment terms, uh, run reports, how to invoice your customers, and I'll show you all the great free programs that do this stuff. Chapter 10 is about the all-important local lead generation agreement. This is how you write a contract that's going to protect both you and your client from any problems down the road. Um, I go over a sample contract of something that I've used on my own business and give you examples of what to do and what not to do. You should never start working without one of these contracts in place, so this is a really important chapter. Next up is landing page design and optimization. I'll go over all the important points about how to design a landing page to do these kind of campaigns. I'll show you my best converting templates. I'll also show you best tips and strategies on how to optimize these pages. Um, I'll show you what tools to use, how to test, and what to test. Chapter 12 is about how to run an effective trial for a new client and how to convert that trial into a long-term relationship with that client. Chapter 13 is where it really starts getting good. This is where I tell you all the top paid traffic sources for local lead gen. I'll tell you the order of effectiveness. I'll also go over all the other methods of driving traffic to these kind of campaigns, both free and paid. Chapter 14 is probably the longest chapter in the whole course. This is about how to build local campaigns for each of the traffic sources that I mentioned in the previous chapter. I also go through all the topics of tracking and analytics in detail. There's a lot packed into this chapter. I'll show you tools, tactics, strategies for AdWords, Facebook, all the other traffic sources. In the local search section, I'll tell you how to utilize local search results from the big three search engines in your local lead gen campaigns. Uh, local is a whole different game than normal pay-per-click, so I'll go over all the strategies to use on things like Google Maps and profile pages and things like that. This is really current info, including all the latest updates from Google's local ad extensions and click-to-call programs. In Chapter 16, I'll go over all the offline methods of driving traffic to local lead gen campaigns. Things like TV, radio, newspaper, billboards. I'll show you how to use solid tracking techniques to actually measure ROI on these kind of campaigns. The next section is all about the potential problems that can happen when you do this kind of work. Basically I go over all the things that have happened to me over the years and then I'll give you strategies to use so these things won't happen to you. And finally in the last chapter we get to talk about scaling local lead gen to the next level. This is all about how to expand, automate, hire people, basically how to do everything you can to grow your local lead gen business beyond your local area. So that's about it. If you've got this far in the video, hopefully I've given you enough information to decide if you want to purchase this course. Uh, the local lead gen market is still totally untapped for the most part, and I really believe that anyone who wants to succeed using these strategies can do so. Uh, hopefully this guide can help you achieve that. So best of luck to you. Thanks for watching. Take care.